Hey, howdy, hi, good morning. It's time to do some Sent to Scorch resets in the old sword and shield. And by resets, I just mean encounters because that's the word that I was looking for. I hope everybody's having a good day. What's up, Hassan? What's going on, Ice Type? Good to see you guys. Uh, yeah, so we're going to be going for um, Sent to Scorch. Hopefully getting it. We'll see. It's Sunday. So we're going to hang out in the YouTube shorts. What's up, Carson? How's it going, bud? Let's see how it goes. Hey, what's up, Chloe? Ooh, am I on the right one? There we go. Uh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm trying to get my, uh, my auto counter to work, as is always what seems to be a bit of a, uh, a challenge, but, you know, it's a good time. Hey, Arrow, thank you so much. Welcome in, buddy. There you are. Hey, Carly, how's it going? I had this working right before, right before stream. Right before the old stream skis, it was working. Yeah, we'll see. What's going on? I've been on such a roller coaster today. Wow. No context to choose one. Summon the end or dead channel? Uh, summoning the end. Do it. Summon the end. You gotta give context after, though. Even if you don't ask for it before, I think I gotta, I gotta have it after. I think I deserve that. There we go. Auto counter is working, baby. We're on it. My first PLA shiny decided I want to catch my PLA shinies in heavy balls. I'm so mad at myself. Yeah, that's really silly. That's a silly decision. You've made a silly choice. You silly, silly, silly person. But hey, I mean, it just adds a little extra challenge to it, right? And once you get good at like the back shots of it, you won't have to worry too much because that's like a big part of the game anyway. Getting that bonus. Blue Stolly songs from the Dead Channel trilogy. Interesting. Uh, what was the first one? Was it a Shanks? Was it a Bidoof? Was it a Starly? Or was it a Geodude? Just honestly the worst. Just the worst. But which one of those was it? It was one of those for sure. It was a Starly, a Shanks, a Geodude, or a Bidoof. Almost would guarantee it. Almost would bet my life on it. Which might be silly, but that's how I'm feeling. Thanks everybody who's hanging out. If you're over here on the YouTube short side of things, if you just hold your hand down on the screen, I think, or maybe click three dots in the top right corner to allow you to like the stream, that would be amazing. Ponyta, no, it wasn't side quest from a mass outbreak. Nice. I believe, uh, <clears throat> you gotta do, you gotta do an alpha hunt though. Like that's really what you gotta do once you get the charm. I think you'll have fun doing those. There's also, like, I can send you, there's five different paths for alpha flyovers where you can see every single alpha that's on a PLA map. Um, I'd be happy to send that your way because it is actually awesome to be able to hunt um, <clears throat> multiple alphas at one time. Like, you can get 18 alpha checks at a time. But, yeah. I don't know, it's neat. Such a good game. Yeah, I genuinely, like, that's, that is one of my favorite Pokemon games of all time. It's so fun. It was very grindy, though, I will say. Well, Carson, that doesn't sound like a good thing. Why weren't you being nice? Kind of loving the grind? Mm, I don't know. It wasn't. It wasn't. 
It was cool because it was brand new, but like on a second playthrough, I it was I wouldn't want. It. I don't think I would ever play through that game twice. <clears throat> I don't think there's any incentive to play through it twice, to be honest. But like getting everything up to research level ten, uh, it was fun because it was so new. I wouldn't do it again, and I'm hoping that they change that in uh, Legend Z. Like genuinely hope that they fix that. Because once the newness wore off, it was just kind of like, oh. That's why I don't want to do it again. But perfecting the decks is really good for your shiny odds. Like, it goes up substantially. Substantially. I said that like I'm totally from the Midwest. Um, but yeah. Just hope for quick balls. Hmm. Mmm. Mmm. Why did you choose Quick Ball? Why was that, like, the ball of choice? I don't understand that. I feel like it's the most- I feel like it's the most hated, like, ball. Like, across the board. But then you come along, and you're trying to make it cool. Mostly Spite Razzy. Okay, it all- that all tracks. Everything is tracking out. Everything is checking out. It all tracks. Understood. Like the level 10 decks, however, they lower the requirement. Like, Raichu needs the. So yeah, exactly. Like, that's just too grindy. I don't want to go through every Pokemon and do a move a billion times. Like, that's. For me. For me, that's just not Bonita. Lack of Bonita. But, I don't know, like I completed the requirements for Nine Tails because I wanted to hunt that one, um, <clears throat> which I did. And then I also 100%ed, I think, Raichu, because I've been hunting that one for a while. I have a couple, like, off-stream hunts right now that are just absolutely draining my life force. Um, I've officially lost... I don't know, probably 30 hours to a Zerka tree and probably equally as much. Uh, but yeah. Thanks for the help. Oh yeah, Legion, for sure, man. I'm glad you got it figured out. Like, that's what I'm doing right now is I'm not even using the plugin. I'm just, uh, vertical through OBS on a separate profile. Cam still hasn't found the shiny Deoxys. Oh, he's just over odds. Like, if this goes as long as his Arceus goes, he'll get to almost 27,000 encounters. And realistically, it could. Like, four times over is unlucky, but it is... it is possible. Unlucky, but possible. Anybody doing anything for St. Patrick's Day? I'm honestly afraid to go drive. I feel like it's going to be so busy and so packed. I just don't know if I have the motivation to get out in my car. But... Four over odds on a DA hunt. With no... With no, uh... Phases, though. Because 4 over odds when phases are an option, in my opinion, is different than 4 over odds when phases are not an option. Since on Discord? I did. I did. Phases. 433 with 10 phases. So... Realistically, 433 DAs, 10 phases, is 1 phase every 43 Dynamax Adventures. That's different than hunting one standalone creature. In my opinion. In my opinion. I know that the odds are the same, but I feel like there's just, there is a bit of a categorical difference. Because, like, if you only saw Cresselia... Well, I guess there's not really a difference, is there? Not really. Just encountering four. 
Still 4x over odds. Yeah, I mean, that just stinks. There's not really a difference. I was, I was mistaken. I misspoke. Forgive me, father. I have sinned. All right. Agreed. Gym leader Hassan has taken the uh, the right approach here. Carson, I'm sure if you are genuinely sorry for what you did, and you apologize to the right people, and you don't get defensive and don't fight, and just say I was wrong, this is where it's at. I'm sure they would give you a second chance. What's up, Storms? I'm doing good. Doing real good. Just, uh, you know, rock and rolling. Is this digital card, Nick? Kieran, it is. It is. Shiny Skirupi? Nice. In a DA? I'm assuming. Is that in a DA? No, that must be in PLA. That's gotta be in something else. What's up, Kieran? How's it going, bud? Good to see you. You're everything you hate right now? Well, it's just kind of, it's just honestly kind of fitting. It's just the self-loathing that I desire on a Sunday. I am the digital trading card. Yeah, Hassan, that's why I said it must be PLA. Was it PLA? Was it PLA? Was it PLA? So true about bike. So true about bike. I was so mad because on my flight home from Atlanta, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna go hunt massive mass outbreaks because to this day, I still had not had a shiny from a, a shiny alpha from a master or massive mass outbreak. Wow, this, this is a struggle. What a dumb story. So I go to the uh, the field lens, and I'm like, oh cool, massive mass outbreaks. Oh cool, alpha horde. Oh cool, mime junior. I got a shiny Alpha Mime Jr. That was my first ever Alpha from a horde where I did not use, uh, what do you call it? Like, the things. The stages or whatever, the, the things. I got bras in Atlanta. I do. I do. I don't. I don't. Permutations, yeah. Because I think permutations are cheating. So I've only done it one time and then I promptly released the shiny. I got broads in Atlanta. Ba -da -da -da. <laughs> All right, here we go. Yeah, what's up? I'm being destroyed by this Ursa Luna. You gotta sing to it. It's the one time where you use the switch microphone. If you sing to the Ursa Luna, it doesn't fight as hard. But you have to specifically sing the Bare Necessities from the Jungle Book. That's true. Carly, for someone who doesn't like really love combat and panicky situations in a game, I cannot wait for you to fight Arceus because you're going to be freaking out. Cannot wait for that. What's up, gaming bud? 
Hope I'm joking? Joking about what? I don't joke. I always tell nothing but the truth, the whole truth, so help me God. Thank you to whoever just subbed. Maybe that was you, Gaming Bud, if that was you. Appreciate you. If it wasn't, make sure you say who you are so I can say, what up? Thought of Carly hucking balls makes me laugh. The thought of Carly shucking corn makes me laugh. Maybe just hucking and shucking involving Carly is just something that's just giggle-inducing. Like, think about Carly just sitting over a trash can, just, just shucking corn. Just shucking so much corn. Stinky! Nah, not blue stinky. About the bear song thing? No, dude. It's serious. Coded right into the game. Tried to take on Alpha Rapidash. I was legit in a pure state of panic. Oh, you're gonna have so much fun. You're gonna be blown away. When you have to fight Arceus... Your life is gonna be blown halfway to Siberia. And it was me who subbed. I love it. What's up, the swaz bros? What's going on, dude? Good to see ya. Welcome back. Card hitting crouch instead of sprint. Classic. Classic crouch sprinter. Dude, me and my buddy Scott played some Fortnite last night, and we were electric. It was so good. We started getting the Ares gun, which is like this sick AR. It was wild. You can sprint? Oh, yeah. Good old PLA filament. The good good. Nice for smooth, smooth sanding. Into that nice finish. 1250. Alright, so that's 50 checks in 20 minutes. That's actually pretty good. 150 an hour is, is pretty spot on. I like that. So we will be at odds by about 10... 10. A.M. Eastern Standard Time. But hopefully we don't get to odds. I'd love to go under... Have you got the Groudon and Latias? Not, uh, Latios? Not yet. Latias, I have, but not the Groudon. Ba -da -da -dum. I'm, oh, I'm thinking this week. Definitely this week for one of them, possibly for both of them. He did have a Groudon for 0.2 seconds. True. It's true. This is a, this is a fact. This is a fact. I don't think you guys realize, though, what all went into it. It wasn't just as simple as I reset over the ground up. I have two 3DSs that I have to hit a button to reset. That's not complicated. But at the time, I was also hitting a button that I had to hit the counter to go up. And sometimes my brain doesn't work as good as it should. And so what I need to press when gets kind of mixed up. And so, my brain said, hit the counter button up. My body said, hit the reset button. And that's what I did. And it was just a, it was just a classic, classic Nick mistake. None of us could do what you do. Oh, you definitely could. Shiny Shallows, nice. East or West? My mind's telling me no. But my body... My body is telling me just go to the bathroom instead. Baby. I don't want to hurt nobody. Freaking R. Robert Kelly. I don't think you are allowed to sing that. I changed the lyrics, though, to point out the absurdity of R. Kelly the Human. East, I think. Nice. That kind of was nice. Wonder what it's like to have one. I have two, but they're from Pokemon Go, and Pokemon Go shinies don't count. And that's just it. That's just it. They just don't count. And they never will. They just never will. Too digital. So digital. Oh my god, like the most digital. I would quit. I wouldn't do it. Let me do a DA real quick and I'll let you know. Oh, she's totally gonna get it. First check, grout on DA. First check. First check dub. Oh my god, I realized sexy Psyduck is not down.
That could be a big part of our troubles. We don't have Sexy Psyduck guiding the way. Sexy Psyduck, bring us the luck. Mm -mm. Sexy Psyduck did not bring us the luck. I was hoping it wouldn't. I was hoping it wouldn't. Disturbing Psyduck. He just likes to lift. I can't wait to see these little blue feelers. It's gonna be so nice. I was actually in a band called Little Blue Feelers. Oh, I don't know why I just thought that was shiny. I don't know why. I just I'm riding her Saluna. This is cool. Oh my god. I don't even I don't even want to spoil everything for you. But just enjoy it while you can, okay? Enjoy riding Ursaluna while you can. Because once you get to the post-game, Carly, you will never touch it again. You will never, ever ride Ursaluna ever again. Consider this literally the last time you'll ever jump on it. What's up, Sir Quackington? How's it going? And you won't even do it to spite me. You just will literally never get back on Ursaluna. You'll be like, yeah, well, this is definitely the worst mount in this game. And you just won't do it. You always have to crush my spirit. No, I just like setting realistic expectations for your happiness. I don't want you to sit there and think, wow, this is the greatest thing. It's just not. I wish it was. What can I say except, you're welcome. There actually is an NPC that uses a shiny execute. I actually knew that. It's the only one, right? I don't think anyone else in the series has a shiny. I was watching Clocky doing some awesome stuff last night. Yeah, you need it for like two missions and then you'll never do it again. NPCs in the battle tower and Emerald can also have shinies? Ah, oh, I didn't know that. That's cool. Can you sh do people shiny hunt battle tower? Imagine not liking the stream until now. It was me. I forgot to like the stream. It was me. Hi. I'm the problem. You don't have to not ride Ursula. You need to get Ursula to get the peep block so it's not useless. That's true. That's the only thing it will ever be good, good for. But now, can't you get the peat block? Can't you just have a Pokemon hold a peat block and trade it? I feel like you could just do that. I don't know. I don't remember. I thought like that was a thing you can do now. Can't you get the peat block in other games? Or is it still just Arceus? I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. No held items in this game? There's no held items in your game, dude. Congratulations, you've received a hundred messages today with Restream Chat. Well, look at that. Thank you, Restream Chat, for allowing me to have a hundred messages sent. Beautiful. Beautiful morning. It's a beautiful day. How's everybody's weather today? And also, what's your mailing address? I'm just kidding. Don't tell me the second part. But seriously, how's your weather today? Let's talk about the weather. It's cold here, and I'm ready for it to not be cold here, because I want to fire up my smoker, and I want to smoke some meat. I haven't been able to smoke meat. It hasn't been nice enough to smoke meat. Maybe I'll smoke meat. It'll do this week. Quite unusually sunny. Nice. Like that. Maybe I'll smoke some meat anyway. Even though the weather's not perfect. Sometimes you just gotta do it. You just gotta power through. Gray, but okay. Mm. Isn't that just like, is the UK just always gray? I feel like the UK is always just gray. But then I'm sure that's not. Like when I watched Ted Lasso, they managed to film only on sunny days, which is really interesting. 
So maybe it's less than it actually feels like it is. Oops. Sunday mailing out just one, two, three, Sesame Lane on Park Avenue Saturn. Nice. I like it. Rude. No, no, no. It wasn't it wasn't an insult or a dig. It was a question. It was a question, because like when I lived in Halifax, which is a probably like English settled North American town or city, it was right on the ocean. And it was always foggy and always gray. Sunshine was was rare. Yo, what's up, Serdova? How we doing, buddy? Good to see you. Thanks for stopping in, man. I hope your Sunday is uh, going swimmingly, as Michael Phelps would say. Halifax in the UK is the same. Dude, you guys should go to Halifax in Canada. It's like the coolest city ever. Love Phelps. Super good dude. Oh my god, Carly, I have a video I want to send you. I think you'd like it. Hey, what's up, Brendan? The only thing I don't like about Restream is I can't see who's a member or who's a mod. It does not give me that uh, luxury here. But that's okay. Okay, Carly, I'm going to send it to you because you're going to giggle. You're going to be like, ha, 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 Nick. Ha, 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 Nick. You're so funny, Nick. Ha. Huh. Thanks, Nick. Thanks for sending me that. I literally just started typing Carly into my like phone contacts to find you. So I realized that's not how our friendship is. All right, here we go. Find Carly May. Under pin messages. For avoid on weekends. Turn off my do not disturb. And send. There you go. Weird way to ask for my number. I think I'm starting a new sword playthrough. Got a few legendaries. I caught nine shiny on my main. Dude, I was in the exact same boat. What shiny am I looking for? I'm looking for Senta Scorch. Um, Dova, I played it one time. I dislike Short's live streams. Dark, listen. Some people dislike them, some people tolerate them, some people hate them, some people love them. It's a tough, tough world to play in, but uh, sometimes you gotta just do what you gotta do. And, uh, you know, channel growth is a big thing. I gotta sneeze, so I'm gonna do that. But then I think it's it's worth noting, you don't have to, uh, you don't have to stick around if you don't want to. I'd love to have you here, but if this is not your vibe, by all means, buddy, go do something that is your vibe. Go find another stream, go outside, go take a shower. Uh, yeah. I think a lot of people just caught legendaries and thought nothing about it. Well, I, I always knew that they could be shiny because I got into it a little bit late. But then there were certain ones where I definitely was hitting the copium and I was like, mm, I like this one more, more than I like the regular shiny. And that was before I started shiny hunting. So I kind of shot myself in the foot that way. But yeah, Dova, do it. You can speed run through Pokemon Sword in not that much time. And then I'm sure you can get somebody to help you with Dax too. What's up, Molly? How's it going? Molly's a great song. Alright, here we go. We are getting so close to 1300 with no shiny. Carly, I actually have no idea why I just sent you that video. Like, I'm sitting here going, why did, why? She probably won't like that. Do you play Roblox? Uh, I used to, I don't anymore. I used to play lots of hide and seek. What's up, Naza? How's it going? Naza, Naxa, I never know. I like to do X's like Zaz, but that's probably wrong. Uh, yeah. Shiny hunting Dreadnought, nice. What game are you hunting in? Uh, got maybe 60 of the 300 in home and then Athena helped offered to help. Yeah, you're gonna be set. So, realistically, what you can do in a new playthrough is just go grab something from Dynamax Adventures and you can rock through the entire game, usually with like a team of three level 70s. Just say nay if it's easier. Yeah, but I like to say it how you want it to be said. It's your name. And as they say, there's nothing better than hearing your own name out of the voice of someone else. Mouth of someone else? In the voice of someone else? Words. Words. Is Dreadnought not only in Sword and Shield? No, it's in uh, Scarlet and Violet as well. Den is a word. Den is a word. Bird is the word. Oh, yeah. Shines, I believe in you. I believe in you, Justin. Thank you for two months of support here, buddy. That's really, really kind. 
So awesome. Charlie. Isn't it just so funny? I did. I did genuinely find that funny. Hey, happy St. Patrick's Day to you too, Molly. Yes, I did find that funny. Well, okay, if you say so, Nay, then I will save myself the trouble, or maybe I'll just pronounce it incorrectly every time. Harley, did you not find that funny? How did you not find that funny? Look at his reaction, it was so good. I don't know, I found it funny. That's the same, those are the same guys that made that, uh, two for one pitchers, uh, sketch. So I guess maybe they're just hit or miss for you. It's okay. Oh, but, but Carly, his grandma's fine. His grandma will be fine. Uh, <laughs> oh man, that's so rich. That's rich. So that Scorch is cool. I like it. Hey, what's up, Billy? How's it going? Back to playing Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate while watching streams. Man, do they just keep adding words to Monster Hunter game titles? Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate World? Like, are they just gonna keep appending words on until it's just the longest game title in the history of game titles? Really like Adamin? I do too. You're gonna find that there's some, uh... There's some tie-ins to other games. Which is kinda cool. Send a Scorch to Shiny could've been a lot better. Yeah, <clears throat> I think... I have yet to see it in the game. That's my thing. I don't know. I don't really judge a shiny based on the gifts and like the pictures. I like to see it actually in the game because I tend to find that like the 3D models of what you see here actually look a little bit better. But I agree. It's okay. Uh, to the expansion, a game got ultimate added in their names. Ah, uh, gotcha. I like it in the game. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Hopefully we see it today so I can find that out. It's my favorite Pokemon type. I like fighting types. I find fighting types to be the coolest. Um... um yeah, I don't know. I think I like fighting types because... There are, actually, I know why I like fighting types. When I was a kid, I used to play these games and I didn't really care too much about battle strategy. I just cared more about punching and just getting through the game and being as strong as possible. And it just felt like fighting types were that. So Scorch is one... Is those ones before Rivera was... I'm not going to use but end up using it during the playthrough. Uh, I, I mean, it's G-Max form is also really cool. I'm wrong. I mean, it could be. Usually it's in that case it's with 3DS games, we've got MH3, MH3U, MH4, MH4U, and Generations, Generations Ultimate. Gotcha. Always knew you love to scrap. Hey, nothing wrong with a good scrap. What's my opinion on Legends ZA? Uh, I don't really have strong opinions yet. Um, God knows I will. But, I'm... I'm uh, cautiously optimistic about it, I suppose. My opinion is just that uh, Pokemon Legends Arceus was a huge success and a huge triumph as far as the Pokemon um, universe and the direction of the series was going. I really like what they did. Um, However, it had flaws, and I'm hoping that in this game, it will address some of those flaws, despite knowing that it'll probably introduce new ones. But I, I do hope that they address some of those flaws in, uh, in PLZA. How many floors? Floors. Big, meaty claws. 
Here we go. We are over 1300. I will say, auto counter is the way to go. If you are a shiny hunter and you are not using auto counter yet, defo got to get on it. Pokemon Plaza this whole time. That's pretty good. Someone just told me I smell of potatoes. Wow. Megas are back. Okay. So this is a... Uh, this is a theory that I have. It will not be Megas the way that it has historically been. It will. It will. But there's going to be also something else. It's going to be a different introduced gimmick. Megas will still exist, but there's going to be something else that gets introduced as well. That's my, my theory. Hey, take care, Molly. Have a great St. Patrick's Day. Thank you for stopping in. Hopefully, we'll see you again soon. Permanent, me permanent megas? No, nothing like that. Um, I just have a feeling that there will be <clears throat> some different, different gimmick associated with the mega. We'll see. It's also interesting that it's a Legends game that's set in the future. Like, to me, Legends is something that is like old, like a historic legend. You don't really hear about too many futuristic legends because it doesn't exist. But we'll see how they tie that in. But I guess legend could refer to legendary Pokemon as opposed to else. Zords. I want to see Psyduck splice with a Zygarde. Listen, pig and elephant DNA just don't splice. I feel like it's going to be both. I think there'll be some back and forth travel. That'd be cool. That'd be really neat, actually. It's obviously in the past, Shiny, because there's too many hints to the parachute development plan historically not to be made in the past. I don't know. It's not really in... How do how we know that, though? Has, has that been officially announced? Because if so, I just didn't know that. The trailer was way too futuristic, then. That's very misleading. That's actually the case. I'm, I'm shocked by that, but if people are just speculating, or someone like HDV said it's set in the past, then I don't really give it too much. Don't really give it too much stock. No slight against HDV. Okay, well then, that's cool. Just a misleading trailer, I guess. I just, I, that's interesting to me. It's an interesting creative decision. When did I last? When did you last? Okay, but so Dova, is there any official? Is there any official or is it just speculation? Because like Lumios, I don't know. It's just interesting. Really, really interesting. We'll see. Like I said, I don't really have a strong opinion one way or another. It'll be what it'll be. It'll probably disappoint some people. Some people probably love it. Some people will be clinically obsessed with it. This is how she goes. I'm just glad we have to wait until 2025. I just couldn't handle another new Pokemon game to, to do. Nothing official as of yet. Okay, so all the people who are saying that it's in the past, you don't have any evidence. No proof. How's my 3DS doing? Dude, it's crushing it with the wormholes. Crushing it with the wormholes. The map that appeared is an old map, meaning it's in the past. I mean, old maps can be in the future. Like, I can look at an old map today. In Pokemon Sword and Shield, you're dealing with relics that are super old. <clears throat> Hope he gets Groudon before you. He's on his way. He's got... <clears throat> I think he finished all of Gen 1 Legendaries in... 1,600 encounters total, I think. Burfrow gets the evolution. Ah, welcome back. That was quick. 
super fast. This game takes place in the Kalos region in Lumio City where the urban development plan is underway to reshape the city. Oh, well there you go. Yeah, but urban development plan could easily not- it, that doesn't mean that it's in the past. Urban? <coughs> Ur I, that just doesn't necessarily indicate past. Like where in that does it say that it takes place in the past? And we know that Kalos is the name of the region. Whereas before, it went from Hoenn to Sinnoh. So, like... Just saying, there's nothing in there that solidifies and says this is in the past. Took like 169 years to develop modern France. Yeah, and they- or Hisui to Sinnoh. Yeah, sorry, Hisui. And they still don't even have proper showers. Urban to me has nothing to do with the time zone. That's just because you're a huge Keith Urban fan. I don't think that the term urban was used to describe areas around major cities until like modern times. Like urban is not a past term. It's not a historic term. That's that's like a relatively new term. What's up, Ella? What about the Arizona guy? Maybe. We are rapidly approaching odds. Bella, how many times have you gotten this one already? Just means a more populated area, like a town city versus village rural. Yeah, definitely, but I think that the term urban is not like something that would be used to describe something historically. Gotten what? Uh, send a scorch. I figure like anytime I start doing a hunt, you start doing a hunt and you get it after like 12. But maybe not. Remember that time that you beat me to star you? I remember. We haven't had a stinky in a while. Where's that in Galar? Which, where's what? I haven't done that hunt. That one doesn't much for Legends Arceus if we do go back to that Paris Redevelopment Plan era. You never know. Where are you in the game? I'm in the giant's foot. <clears throat> I'm in the giant's foot. Um, yeah, I don't know. That's all I'm saying is, I don't care if it's in the past or if it's in the future, but blind assumptions. They'll be the death of all of us. Can we add as a friend in game? Uh, you can. I think if you type exclamation FC, it'll add my friend code. Or it'll, it'll send my friend code. Jubilife Town is also the thing with Urban. Keith Urban. That giant's foot gets some shoes and socks? That's what I'm saying. Like, I don't want to see the giant's foot. It's not my thing. Oh. I'm sore. My body hurts. My body is aching. Got an aching body. Why are there so many Pokemon games that have some connection to past and future? It's just a gimmick and you lean into it, I guess. They started, then they can't stop, like Pringles. Pokemon's pretty good at leaning into their, like... I don't know. Finding their... Carving out their little niche. And then just diving in, head first.
Anything interesting for breakfast? I'm not having breakfast. I'm gonna push right on through till uh till lunch, and then I think I'm gonna have a spaghetti sandwich, because I'm in the mood for a spaghetti sandwich. Such an influencer. Influencer. So you're fasting? Nah. I usually don't eat breakfast. Spaghetti sandwich. Oh, yeah. Big time spaghetti sandwich guy. Literally had cornflakes? How were they? Carly, have you never had a spaghetti sandwich? This is strange to me because you do have all the components. Is that from some obscure sketch show? No, it's like an actual thing. I cannot be the only person that has had a spaghetti sandwich. Eminem literally sells them at his uh, mom's spaghetti restaurant. What's up, Maddie? How's it going? Like they're an actual menu item. You guys, sandwich sounds very crazy. You guys are missing out. You just take like some standard white bread. You can toast it if you want to. You can toast it and make it garlic bread. It is a thing, very American. Maybe, but it's so good. It's so good. So that's what I'm gonna have. I'm gonna have a little spaghetti sandwich. Freaking love spaghetti sandwiches. They're so good. Especially re like second date pasta and sauce. My god. My goid. Sale on Square Enix games? Hmm. I've played like two of those. I was big into Kingdom Hearts for a while. Then it became too much. Like Pringle sandwiches? I do like putting chips on a on a good sandwich. Doritos in particular. Mmm. Mmm. I eat spaghetti sandwiches. I also eat spaghetti tacos. I've never done the spaghetti taco. I had a bagel, toast with cream cheese, chili flakes, sea salt, and thinly sliced cucumber. That sounds super good. What was the cream cheese? Was it just like a standard issue cream cheese or like a flavored cream cheese? I'm actually going to make bagels today. I've been wanting to make them for a while and just haven't gotten around to it, but today is the day. Bagels would be made. Some jalapeno cheddars. You like spicy food? Uh, I do. Within reason. Standard issue cream cheese. Mmm. I like, uh, I like spicy food within reason. As long as the heat has flavor, I, I really can eat any spicy food, but as long, if the heat is just heat, then I'm not a big fan of that. If over 500 plus hours in Sword and Shield and Scarlet and Violet, uh, yeah, probably makes sense. Yori, you think that's bad? I'm not even touching the tip of the iceberg for some people. Yeah, that sounds about right. What's up, Skrillbo? Once ate four jalapenos at the same time? Brutal. That's not even his final form. What's up? Aqua Phantom. Pika, hi. Pika, hello. What's going on? Good to see you. Your thoughts on the Smashing Pumpkins? Uh, I don't really have thoughts one way or another. I hear that Billy Corgan's kind of a bad guy, but uh, not a bad guy, but just kind of like a doo-doo butt. Um, but the music that I do know, like, I don't know, I don't remember the exact title of the album, but Melancholy and the Eternal Sadness, I think, is something close to that, or Melancholy or something. Um, yeah. I like it. You have Pokemon Unite? Uh, I don't. Pokemon Unite is not a fun game, in my opinion. What are the odds for the shiny one in 1,365? Sure, I'm always busy when you're streaming. Oaks, listen, I don't do it to, I don't do it to get, uh, to, to, to get you out of chats. I just have to stream when I can stream. Stinky, let's go, come on. Stinky. Truly stinky. Ba, ba, da, ba, da, ba, ba. What's up, folks? Geez, yeah, it's, I mean, it's not terrible, I suppose. A lot of artists, their sound has changed over the years. Yeah, definitely. It's tough to find an artist who's been consistently good throughout all of their album releases. Like, that's, it's a, it's probably the most difficult thing in music, actually, is finding an artist who, from start to finish, every album is different, but good. 
Um, <clears throat> some can be better, but they don't really have any, like, misses. Um, I, I can only think of a handful, honestly. I dare you to catch the shiny? Dude, I'm trying everything I can, but first it's gotta show up. As soon as it shows up, we'll catch it. Whitney Houston. Okay, so, despite all the jokes I make about Whitney Houston. Okay, so I want to start that. I'm gonna start that by saying this is not going into one of my standard, standard Nick-isms. What do you think about Death Cab for Cutie? They make me so sad, but they're good. Not to be that girl, but Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift has had some stinkers. Reputation was a garbage fire of a frickin' album. Anyone who thinks it isn't is just a Taylor Swift diehard. Reputation was terrible. Um, okay, so Carly. Whitney Houston actually has, like, the craziest voice I've ever listened to. Can I ask something real quick? Absol 101, you can ask something as long as you want to. You don't even have to make it quick. Slow it down. Come on. Sometimes it's not about the journey. It's about the destination. But yeah, like her voice is actually insane. I watched her sing in the U.S. National Anthem because I was like, there's no way this is as good as people say it is. Like, that girl is perfect. Hey, Absol. Um... Listen, if you're still hanging out here, I hope that someday you die of the incurable disease of being a little bitch. Who says things like that in a YouTube chat? Get out of here. What a horrible person. Dare to catch 10 Pokemon? Nah, not gonna do that. ba da -dum. But the answer is clearly Jason Derulo oiled up, right? Like, like, clearly, that is the answer between those two. It's definitely, I mean, Carly, it's definitely Derulo, right? <laughs> I mean, come on, it is. I mean, it is. <laughs> Aside from her singing career, isn't she giving money to charities and Republicans? Uh, I think she's dead. So... Oh, are you- wait, are you talking Taylor? Are you talking Taylor or Whitney Houston? Oh. No, Taylor's like the biggest hypocrite in music. Taylor's one of those people that, like, pretends to care. That's the sad part. She pretends like she cares. Because it looks good, but she doesn't really care. Which is okay, I guess. I mean, if you got billions of dollars. Who's better, Bisharp or Pikachu? Mmm, Pikachu. B-Sharp, it's Pikachu. Uh, thank you to Mr. or Mrs. 2189, super appreciate you. We are just 11 away from 2200, which would be a cool thing to hit on this Sunday. A cool grand. Uh, anyone in chat help me evolve, trade some Pokemon for my living decks? Uh, you already stopped. I don't know if you have, I don't know if you have Discord or not. But if you do, you should join up. There's lots of people that would trade there. Um, if there is someone here who's willing to help, I will allow it. But um, I try and typically keep trades out of my chat just because they can really bog things down with people going back and forth and saying, okay, here's my, here's my freaking code, here's your code, okay, blah, blah, it's just a lot. Something about, uh, Pikachu that's actually amazing is, did you know that it was a, like, woman that voiced Pikachu? It was not an actual Pikachu doing the own the own voice. I thought that was crazy. I was expecting, like, they would hire a Pikachu to do Pikachu's voice, but no, they hired a person instead. Probably something to do with, like, union contracts. I'll have to ask Matt Prokopak. He knows about those things. Someday when he comes in, I'll ask him and see if he knows. No, I swear to God. You can look it up. It was a, a young woman. It was not a... It was not a Pikachu.
Well, life was blind. That's what I'm saying. When I found out, I genuinely, like, could not believe it. I was sitting here thinking, wow, like, Pikachu must have really gotten a jump start by doing those voices, but mm -mm. <laughs> Aqua Phantom, I don't actually know who you're talking to right now. And I'd be lying if I said I did. You're talking to me? You're talking to me? You talking to me? So Bart wasn't really voiced by a little yellow rascal? No, he actually was. Uh, Bart was actually voiced by a boy with severe jaundice. It's not very funny to talk about, Kieran. Oh my god. Here's some cookies, thanks. I like cookies. You reached the light goal. Oh man, we should probably get another one. BRB, gonna get a shower? Dude. A great shower. <clears throat> yeah, Kieran, I, I can't believe that you would... I can't believe that you would just bring that up. Let me do it. Carly, do it. Do it. Do it. Alright, we got four checks before we can make history happen. I have never seen a Pokemon shine on 1365. It's gonna happen today. It's the luck of the Irish. Throw me under the bus like that. Listen, I just want you to be a better person. Oh, Kieran, I wish you would have been in chat yesterday for the debate. Aqua Phantom, I don't really know what you're saying, because you're replying to things that I can't, like... You're just saying okay and me too and yes. I need you to, like, actually say what you're talking about here. Because so you're just dropping, like, random agreeisms. What did I miss? Oh, Kieran. I can't even begin to... I, I'm not going to get back into it again. But it was beautiful. I talked a lot about the country that I am natively from. And that's the end of that. It was really good. It was quite good. Alright, here we go. 1365. It either is or it isn't. Ah, I didn't hit it yet. We also have a stinky that I'm going to run into first, just in case there's a secondary stinky. I like to have two potential stinkies. Like goal 35. That is catnick doing a little poo on my face. Right, here we go. I like it. Send you the luck of the Irish. This is what I need. This is what I need right now. Okay, here we go. 1365. That was a stinky, but it wasn't a good stinky. Oh, no. Stinky. Okay, we're good. All right, here we go. Where is it? Where is number 1365 Senna Scorch? Can we make magic happen? I can't. I can't keep running into other things. This is driving me nuts. I like this. Let's get some shamrocks in the chat. Let's get some shamrocks for a little bit of luck that we are going to, for the first time, break all shiny hunting barriers. We're going to be absolutely legendary. Absolute legacies. No, it didn't work. What a bummer. That would have been so cool if it did, though. That would have been so cool if it did. We would have been cemented as, like, the greatest shiny hunters of all time. Uh, but now we're just existing. Garchomp. Couldn't have said it better myself if I tried, buddy. Yeah, Molly, you went a little hard on the uh, four-leaf clovers there, but it's okay. Okay, we live, we learn, just like Alanis Morissette. Garchomp is your favorite Pokemon? I would have swore it was Pikachu, based on all the Pikas that you were hitting me with. Whoa, my chat is freaking out. What is happening? This is the premier short stream experience. The premier. Have you gotten something good, Mr. Businessman? I got you in the chat now to talk to me about business. Oh, good. Good. I hope you did it justice. Because if you don't do it justice, it's going to come off very bad. Very bad. Huge. Hugely bad. Very bad. But it wasn't, though. It was just simply a... It was just simply a discussion of cunning linguists. And that's what I was doing. Just some linguistics. Pikachu or Garchomp? Nice. Those are the good ones. 
The shinies for both are kind of doo doo butt, but. Can't believe you would say that about Hefty. Hefty wanted nothing to do with it. Hefty ran away so fast. And I don't even understand why, because Hefty, of all people, should have understood. But nope. Hefty did not understand. Hefty went so quiet. Until I talked about how the log had a child, Hefty did not want to speak. What are the shiny odds? For this one, it is 1 in 1,365. So we are officially now 7 checks over odds. What was the deal with the Absol guy? I was just busy hunting and saw general disappointment. Uh, he just came in and said something completely inappropriate. Something that didn't need to be said. Um... And so, yeah, that's basically it. He's just not a not a good dude. Well, he's one of two things. The guy that came in was one of two things. He's an, a 10-year-old who thinks he's being funny because he doesn't know how to convey humor other than with being offensive, or he's like a 40-year-old loser. It's one of those two things. There's no in-between. Because when you reach a certain age, you realize you're not funny anymore. You just kind of suck as a person. And when you're at like that 40 plus, it's like, yeah, I can't really change that. And then if you're like 10, it's like, yeah, you don't really understand how terrible you are yet. So if they're anywhere between the ages of 11 and 39, they're just horrible. Gotta run. Got a jet. See you, and Thanks for stopping in, bud. Take care. Talk to you soon. Yo, what's up? Muhammad Arul Rifki Boon Mumar Gaddafi Mo. What's going on? I don't know if I pronounced all that correctly, but what's up? That's a long name. I have a feeling you just go by Mo. I feel like the Mo at the end is like Mo is good. Kids are ruthless without mercy and without empathy. Yeah. What are you doing? I'm shiny hunting a Scorch. What are you doing? I'm just shiny hunting the old Senti Scorch. Play Pokemon emulator. Why would I play an emulator when I have the real deal right here? What benefit would I have to emulating? Playing a legitimate game right in front of you. Do you play Pokemon emulators? How can you notice them in the grass? I can see the little flame tail up a little bit. That's the only thing I can notice is the little the little tail that pops up. Other than that, it is pretty tough to tell. Um, but you also see the little exclamation point too, which helps. Um, so if there's exclamation point and then you see the flame, or at least even like some movement, you know it's not a random. But yeah, it's not the it's not the easiest one to spot. There's one over here. But I was genuinely hopeful that this one would not go as long. Oh my gosh, look at the shiny Groudon. Y'all love talking about that shiny Groudon, don't you? My goodness. Not me, not you. You should try it, it's fun. I like it when people make fun of me for being stupid. Stupid.
Hey, what's up, Crystal? Hey, you had a heck of a stream yesterday. When I was jumping in, I jumped in there for a few minutes, and you had, uh, you had 35 people that were watching. I think you had just gotten raided. It looked really good. Your, also, your uh, mic sounds awesome, too. I don't know what you did for your mic setup, but it sounds really clean. I liked it a lot. I'm not super late on Shiny Mewtwo and Let's Go. That's what I'm saying. Popped in, too? Yeah, you were awesome. It was so good. Stupid, you are not stupid. Oh, sometimes I am, buddy. Sometimes I am. Um, It's always fun having a big crowd like that. It's always fun when you have 30-plus people in there. Lots of movement, lots of conversation, lots of... Lots of things that make you feel like the real deal. It was cool. I was super happy for you. You think Santa Scorch has a good shiny? Um, I think it's okay. I think it's like six and a half, seven out of ten. I'm trying to get as many of the different generation Pokemon as I can, and since this is not available in any other game, Santa Scorch is just one that I'm hunting here. Um but yeah. How old am I? Probably too old to be doing this. Pop in the outside of the house being wrong. What? My mic hasn't always sounded good before. I don't know. I just never really paid attention to it. I've been really obsessive over like audio sounds lately. And so like when I go to uh, individual people's uh, streams, I'm like really listening to figure it out. And uh, yeah, yours was just really awesome. It was super clean. Can I look at your party Pokemon? Uh, there's nothing that good. Carly, yours is super solid too. I think that the um, Wave 3 is really nice. My party Pokemon are Colossal, Trevenant, Glade, Articuno, and then two Milceries. Yeah, I think that the uh, Wave 3 does some good. Yeah, Wave 3 I think is just a good mic. I think it's really nice. Um, this snowball takes a lot of effort to make it sound good. Like, I had to buy a shock mount for it so that when I hit my thing accidentally, it doesn't uh, make this, like, loud, grumbly noise. And then, I really want an XLR mic. That's kind of the next thing on the list for me, is upgrading to an XLR, and eventually updating to a mirrorless camera. There's just lots of, uh, lots of things, but... It's just a lot of learning. Like, learning how to configure audio and tweak it to make it sound good is actually, like, a ton of effort. Um, so, like, I have a plugin right now that adds <coughs> a little bit more bass. So, I think it's a great starter, Mike. You always made it sound better than mine. I think it's just because I added so many different peripherals to it. Is kind of the main thing. But, like, if I get excited, it still peaks. There's no way to prevent it. So, I really want an XLR mic. I want to get myself a mixer and just start to work with that a little bit. But, again, like, learning how to configure audio, it's a huge thing. And I do think I'm pretty good at, like, stream setup and stream configuration and that sort of thing, but audio is just one that really intimidates me. And lighting. Audio light... Basically, the audio-visual lighting side of things, I think, is really tough to get right. It's definitely tough to get perfect. I can say that much. I can get close. Like, I think this mic sounds the best that it sounded in a long time, but that doesn't mean that it sounds great. It just sounds better than it has. Because, like, I'll give you an example. Let's see if you can even notice a difference. So, with my mic... This is what it sounds like with everything off. So I'm sure that you can tell that there's, like, a lot of background noise. Like, if I go silent, listen. Here, I'll even turn my switch off. So do you hear how there's, like, that constant rumble? And it probably just sounds a little bit different. But this is what it sounds like with all my filters on. So first, here's the noise suppression. We don't have any background noise anymore. This is my noise gate, which affects how much noise actually comes in. And it's got a set time to release, come in and out based on noise recognition. So this allows me to like play keyboard stuff with or like press on my keyboard without you hearing it. Like if I'm typing, you can hear it. But as soon as I take it off, you can't. The different compressors also help with uh, volume and making sure that it's always kind of a consistent level. Um, so it tries to stay as consistent as possible. And then this is a plugin that I add in. So right now I don't have any of my plugin stuff. As soon as I turn this on, it adds something called bassy, uh, low and bassy or smooth and bassy, something like that. And it adds a little bit more depth to voice. So this is what it sounds like now. And then this is what it sounds like with the plugin. 
So I don't know if you could even notice any difference. You might not have been able to, but like this is what I'll do is I'll just go through, I'll record, I'll listen to all the different settings and I'll find the ones that I like the most. But yeah, that's that's basically how it works. It's my favorite Pokemon dragon type. Uh, we have a dragon type. Mm, I don't know. It's a good, it's a good question. Um, Rayquaza. Hi, uh, Rayquaza. Yeah, it's definitely subtle. It's not, I don't think it's meant to be like this huge drastic change because I think if you do that too much, it just like, it just alters how your natural voice sounds. I think it's just meant to like enrich certain areas. My favorite fire type. Uh, nine tails. Nine tails for sure, actually. Nine tails, yeah. How about ice type? All ice types should be fired into the sun. They are the worst. But if I had to pick one, I had to pick one. Articuno. Gyarados is my favorite dragon type because it should be a dragon type, right? So silly. Such a silly decision. Now, to be fair, I don't like, uh, I, I like shiny nine tails. I should be very clear about that. Regular nine tails is fine. Shiny nine tails, I think is an awesome, awesome, awesome Pokemon. Like in my top, in my top five, for sure, for sure. But the regular one is just kind of there. But shiny nine tails is, it's the first thing I ever hunted on stream. Shiny Nine Tails. How many badge did I have? Uh, all of them, I suppose, is the answer I would give you. I don't think I've ever played a Pokemon game and not gotten all the badges. So, all of them is your answer. Every badge. Able Nine Tail. Hmm? Like a Lola Nine Tail? Is that what you're trying to say? Phantom, you are a, uh, you're a mystery to me. Like Ice Type Nine Tail, like a Lolan. I actually don't know why they call it Nine Tails. It's so interesting to go from Vulpix to Nine Tails. Like it's a very weird name. I wonder why they named it that. We see Overworld had co-op capabilities. I do too. Total bummer. Big missed opportunity. It would have been so fun to like shiny hunt with people in the in the Overworld. There's now a mod that you can get for this game that has Pokemon shiny in the Overworld, which is kind of cool. Shiny Regi should be illegal. I agree. Get that thing out of there. Put that thing back where it came from. Or so help me. I don't have. Put that thing back where it came from, or so help me. Playing Pokemon Emerald? Nice. It's a good one. It's a great one, actually. Probably could have masseuded this like a hundred times faster, but it's not about that. On a cold and gray Chicago morning, a poor little baby child was born in the ghetto. In the Berto. What's up, Keith? How you doing, buddy? What's up, Mr. Nobody? Have you become Mr. Somebody yet? I was running around, I was looking down. Shiny Garchomp? Question mark? What about Shiny Garchomp? Keith, how do you feel about uh, 
How do you feel about the King's Leon? Oh, that's another one I gotta tell Hefty about. This for somebody is my mate's channel. Ah, makes sense. That's cool. That's cool that you guys are like the dynamic duo of miscellaneous anonymity. Profound knowledge. What's my favorite pseudo legendary Pokemon? Mmm, Arcanine. Arcanine for sure. I like lots of Gen 1 stuff. Not my fave, not my least fave? Yeah, I dig it. I dig it. Shiny Charcadet is also a crime. Agreed. Agreed. Honey, where's my super suit? How am I supposed to know? Chomps your pseudo legendary, nice. Garchomp shiny is just such doo doo. Keith, I'm sorry that I jumped in your uh, voice chat last night and didn't say anything. I was playing Fortnite, but Clocky was like, dude, you have to get in here right now. So I jumped in. That was insane and so awesome. And I hope that he does that on stream because that was so freaking fun. Like, it would be so fun to do a shiny race like that. Cause like he was getting 30 checks a minute. Which is pretty, pretty awesome. Man, Duraludon and this and Tortuga all over odds. My last three random encounter hunts in this game are just Brutal, Mr. Wolf, it must be the next one. You must have meant the next one, not this one, but the one after this. It must be this one, right? Mm, okay, maybe the, maybe the following one. Maybe the one that happens after this one happens. We're just incorrect. I think we're just wrong. I think we are just wrong today. It's just not happening how she should be. There are two wolves in here. There's a she wolf in the closet. We just need one more wolf, and then we can start talking about keyboards. 
Like, Monster Hunter Stories more than most recent Pokemon games. The most recent Pokemon games, like, if you're talking Brilliant Diamond and Scarlet and Violet, they were okay at best. They're fine. They're fine games. But like, Legends Arceus is pretty, pretty solid. The other ones, yeah, they were just, they were just okay. They were just okay. Like, playing this game, and then going into Scarlet and Violet, makes me so sad with what they did. Because, like, this game is just so much better. It looks better, it plays better. Yeah, Aqua, I don't know if you know this or not, but there's like a delay. So, like, when I speak and when you reply, you hear what I say seconds later. So just by saying, like, okay, yeah, mm, okay, all that sort of thing, like, I can't really... I can't really, I don't really know what you're saying. It's tough for me to reply to that, so... Be more, like, direct with what you say. It'll make life a lot easier. Sword Shield is the Pokemon game? Like, that's what I think, too. Like, if I had to... If I had to sum up... Like, what I want out of Pokemon in a game, this one is definitely the closest. This one comes the closest. The only thing that, like, I will be begging for this forever, and it just will never happen. Once you become champion, I think that you should be challenged. That's, that's one of the things that I just want to see happen. Like, when you beat the game, you become champion. Every now and again when you're playing, you should get, like, a notice that's, like, new challenger approaching, or new challenger whatever. And it's, like, an RNG-generated team that you have to go up against. And you don't know what they have, and you have to just bring your best stuff, and if they beat you, you lose champion status, and you have to go and try and win it back. Like, to me, that would be so interesting, because then as you're doing things in the post game, like shiny hunting, or, or breeding competitive teams, that sort of thing, whatever you do, there's at least some degree of, of like, you know, it, it, Thing to do? I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, but I just wish that they would do that. Like, I wish that that was a thing that happened. Because the way that this game, these games have always played, it's like you and your rival are the only two people that ever go through the gym leader challenge and the elite four to become champions. Just two of you. That's it. And like, you fight so many trainers, what? They just like give up? They just stay on a route forever and that's what they do? No. Like, some of those trainers should definitely ha- I don't know. And he can make shinies rare again. I certainly can. Certainly can and I will. But like, It'd be so fun to tap into that element of the game. What happens after you become champion? Well, people should try and challenge you. Alright, Aqua, this is your final warning. You need to contribute something to the chat or you are going to be timed out. Because right now you're not contributing anything. So, this is your last, uh, last warning. Hey, take care, Mr. Wolf. Thanks for being here, buddy. I think Aqua is better than Haunted House, but now I don't know. Man, I want to go to Aqua so much more than I want to go to Haunted House. I don't give warnings. I mean... I think that we gotta judge all people on the, uh... second chances that they're given, you know? Come on, Unbound a fan game? Mine has gotta be, without question, uh... Pokemon Crystal, hefty hype coming in. What's up, Decidueye? Good to see you. Spleef, how we doing? Ranji, Mighty Munchkin, Mr. Tyler Shanks. Who else we got? 
Who else we got coming in on the hefty hype train? Thank you so much, buddy. Tyler, thank you for seven months. What's up, Mighty Munchkin? Good to see ya. Woo. Woo. Oh, woo. Did Hefty get the, uh, did Hefty get the Lele? Hefty get the Tapu Lele. Is he done with Dynamax Adventures or does it continue? What's up, Cito? Good to see ya. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, he didn't get it. Dang it. Dang it, Hefty. I was cheering for you. I was rooting for you. He's over odds? Wow. Of course, the last one would not be a quick one. Because why would it be? Why would it be? Well, thank you, everybody, who's coming on in. I hope you guys had a ton of fun over in Hefty's stream. I'm sorry you didn't get a Dynamax Adventure a Legendary Shiny. Did he get any others? What's up, Hefty? Thank you so much for the raid, buddy. Good to see you. 104 checks. What a bummer. I'm stop talking now. No, you don't have to stop talking. Just, just like, you know, rock it in, roll it in. Uh, today is YouTube membership day. So for anyone who knows what that means, it means that currently I'm getting notification after notification that my, my note or my, uh, memberships are being purchased because they all come out on the 17th every month. Crazy. Well, let's have a little bit of fun. Thank you, Hefty, for coming on in. Let's get, uh... Let's get some of y'all some nifty gifties, huh? Let's get some of you guys some gifted memberships. Nifty! They are nifty! They're nifty gifties. Let's see, we got Neodata, Mediocre Gaming, Plays, LFB, and we got Sal. Rock and roll. It's awesome. Happy St. Patrick's Day to you as well, Classy. The Crystal Classy. I just pick whatever I want. I bounce between the two. Is everybody wearing green today? I am not. I am wearing a uh, soccer kit, though, so that's, like, kind of cool. I didn't get one. Mm, Mighty Munchkin. I mean, we can try again. What's up, Caleb? How's it going, dude? Good to see ya. Caleb, I feel like I spent a century. Do you remember me? Yeah, dude. Caleb, I don't think I would ever forget you if I tried. Last time I kind of comment for something in your stream and video saying I was talk because someone told me to a person what what's up 2000 welcome back mm, I'm not sure how do I like stream on the news how do I like streaming on the new stream thing uh, honestly I think it's fine other times it makes me want to uh, rip my own teeth out so it's a little mix of both How's, how's you doing? How's the fishing? I'm gonna say this again? Wait. I'm confused now. Why are people calling me the cow guy? Because one time, I had an image of someone beating a dead horse, and you said, what are they doing to that cow? And so now you're you're just like, you're just known as the guy. You're just that guy. If you're in the Pokemon world, what team would you be rocking? Team Rocket. Team Rocket. It's true. Fond memories of you. Coming home from Keys, nice. Get anything good? Catch any dolphin?
We are broke house here. How do we get Darkrai, Regigigas, and Shaman and Platinum? Uh, you would need to modify in the events. So you'd have to use a Game Shark or some other uh, kind of exploitation device to give yourself a couple extra things. I don't know about Regigigas, actually. I just know about Shaman and Darkrai. 24 Lobster and what was like five pounds you never went offshore. It was too windy. Dang. 24 Lobster. So do you sell those or are you going to eat them all? Do you have traps? Trying to do Psyduck side quests. I have spoken to everyone. Knows giving me medicine. Uh, you, it's the lady inside of the main hall, I think. Last time I can't count on your stream and videos. It's like because I was told from someone on YouTube and they told me to say bad things to someone that I did not and see. I don't know what you're talking about, but just don't say bad things here and then we'll be in good shape. We don't- we eat them. We don't trap them. We dive and bully net. Oh, cool. That's awesome. Dude, you live such a cool life when it comes to your fishing habits. It's awesome. The nurse joy looking lady in the main hall. Yeah, it's a snow point town which you need the three Reggies. Okay, that makes sense. I was gonna say, I didn't think Reggie Gigas was a event, but yeah. Pokemon series are slowly translated and out of Pokemon Trainer and become a regular person to see how they deal with the repercussions of the journey. Um... I mean, what would the repercussions be? Where's the main hall? Like, the main building that you go to, like... Uh... Like, that main building where you go to where, like, the commander is or whatever. All that stuff. I, can, I was told I can only get the three Regis if I have Regigigas. No, it's the other way around. You can only get Regigigas if you have the three Regis. Moo River Rock! Moo River Roll! Hotel, I caught a 30 pound nurse shark. Dang, dude. That's awesome. Tyler, thank you so much for the lurks, buddy. Yeah, Galaxy Billion with Kamado. Yeah, exactly. Mm, 2000, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't got anything to tell you, dude. You totally can. Uh, it's yours. Just grab it. I'll just send it over. Don't even ask, Maggie. Just bring it. What's up, Razzy? How you feeling? Dad fell in the water while trying to land it. Oh God. The last thing I want to do is land in the water that I'm actively catching a shark from. How to deal with it if it's trauma resurfacing, dude? They are never gonna do that. It's a children's game. Can't have that. This game is not meant for adults. How's your job and day and sleep? Uh, no job today, which is great. Day is good. Sleep was pretty decent. A little less than I wanted, but we made it through. We got it done. I'll just get more tonight. You're playing? Playing what? Hey, what's up, Muhammad? AKA Mo. Maybe Mo. Hey, take care, Mighty Munchkin. Thanks for coming in on that raid. Hope you have a great rest of your Sunday. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Caleb plays. I'm guessing different than Caleb buys. But maybe not. Alright, you would watch... Would you watch that series? No, I probably wouldn't. Hey, take care, Muhammad. Thank you so much for being here. Have a good sleep. Talk to you again soon. It's not an adult game. It's definitely not. How long have you been streaming? Uh, about an hour and a half. You then from the third gen? Really? Seems like a crazy requirement. Make Old Man Logan, but Pokemon version? I think it has a very specific audience. To your child? What? What you talking? What you talking about? What's up, Time Mister? No, Pokemon is just not a game that's designed for adults. It's not a game that has 30-year-old dudes in mind. It's a game that has like 10 to 15-year-olds in mind. I just happen to still like playing it. Well, I Violet working on Shiny Zacian. Nice. Yeah, I gotta get the uh, the code, right? 
The old GameStop code. I don't even know if you can get shiny uh, Zacian anymore. Zakayan. Zacian. Yeah. I think I only have... I don't know if I have both. Are you sure you're not 40-year-olds? You're playing it. Dude, I'm not 40. But yes! I'm positive. Just like how My Little Pony is not designed for older men, but somehow there's still this this group of bronies that watch My Little Pony. I don't get it. I don't get it, dude. It doesn't make sense to me. There's so many other good shows. Why are you watching that? Why are you doing that? Why is that something that you're doing? There's so many shows. There's so many shows. Bad example. Great example. Great example. Are you part of the group? What group? Oh, I don't know what you're talking about, Caleb. What show you want to watch in Pokemon series? I want all of them with Ash and Pikachu. Yeah, I probably, honestly, will never watch anything in the anime other than the original. And I don't even know if I'll watch that again. A little pony group? Nah, dude. I don't. I couldn't even name one pony. Is that a thing? Like, I'm assuming that they are ponies, like, like Spice Pony and Sporty Pony. Posh Pony. Why? Um, I don't know. I just don't really do the anime thing anymore, and I like Pokemon a lot, but I like the games. The other peripherals, the other, other things, they don't, they just don't matter as much to me. You're getting My Little Pony confused with the Spice Girls? Oh, I do that all the time. I'm so sorry. People watch Bluey because they like them. Yeah, it's another thing. I just don't understand. Like, you're an adult. Stop watching children's shows. Unless you're watching it with a child. Like, I will... I will... I'm, I'm open to people in their life. But just because I'm open to what you're doing doesn't mean I'm not going to judge you for it. And, like, if you're an adult without a kid who's watching Bluey, you're very strange. You're very strange. I'm gonna sub. This is actually run to DK. Run to Donkey Kong. <laughs> Thank you for the sub, dude. Appreciate you. I have an unhacked shiny Zamazenta. I have Zacian, not uh, Zamazenta, unfortunately. Thank you for the sub. That's awesome. Appreciate you. My YouTube is broken. I can't see your stream. Honestly, Carly, probably for the better. Probably for the better. Blue's a dog show and colors for a dog. I know what Bluey is. I have a I have a niece who watches it, so I've watched Bluey with my niece. I have a non-hack shiny Arceus. Same, dude. It was pain. Welcome back. Pain is a great way to describe it. Did you get from the BDSP GameStop thing? I did. I did. Yeah, BDSP, it took me, Caleb, it took me four or six thousand, six thousand four hundred and nine encounters. Imagine if you took a dump on stream. Imagine, Fire Specialist. Can you even imagine? Can you imagine what that would be like? God, I don't even know how to begin to talk about what that would be like. Who feels more like a PBS kid show than an actual Disney show? What nun's kid show you like? I don't like kid shows. I don't watch kid shows. Because adult. Full blood adult. I understand why people would watch Pokemon. I get, I get that. I just don't personally do it. I don't get why people would watch My Little Pony or Bluey. I don't get it. That's okay. Do you do. You do whatever you gotta do. Just, that's it. Started an Arceus and I gave up at 1500. Dude, you never give up. Never give up on a hunt. You can take long breaks, but you never quit. Don't quit.
Hey, fire specialist, what if we got an episode where you just didn't exist? What about that? That'd be a sweet episode. Let's let's get that one. Let's find that episode. I'd watch that. You guys have plans to watch the anime together. Wait, why would you do that? Why would you cancel your plans to watch the anime together based on what some stranger that you've never met but watched sometimes on the internet feels about it? That would be such a silly decision. I wouldn't do that. My long break turned this into this. My long break turned into this is boring. I would play Fortnite. I get that, dude. The Ares gun is so good. Stranger, I hardly know her. YouTube Shorts experience. It truly is. It truly was a Shawshank Redemption. Stranger, I mean, to be fair, if you saw me out on the street, you'd be like, don't talk to that guy. Don't think you're so special you're planning it anyway. You were planning to cancel it? Now I'm just confused. Now I'm not follow I'm not following this. Hey, a treasure map. Like Dora the Explorer. One of my favorite TV shows. Now we got Razzy confused. Now it's just the whole thing. Pokemon Horizons. I hear it's actually pretty good, though. What do you have? What do I have? There's a guy that makes me uncomfortable. Oh, buddy. Welcome to the world. There's lots of guys that'll make you uncomfortable. But just like Joe Biden and these gas prices, there's just simply nothing I can do about it. What do we got? Just be blue. It's time to be blue. Yeah, I've heard good things about Pokemon Horizons. To be fair, I have not watched the anime in so long. Do they still lean really heavily into, like, how everything can be solved with friendship? What's up, 74K? Good to see you. Thanks for coming in. He's here on work, and he's... What? Oh, I don't know. I'd say just avoid him. Or try and make him super uncomfortable. Everything can be solved with friendship. It's possible. It's possible. I have Zacian, Rusted Sword, but not Shiny, but I have Zamzenta, Shiny, and Eternatus. My sub count? 1738. What happened to it? Did it disappear? Hey, yeah, what's up, Nico? Don't take advice from a stranger on the internet. That's me. Technically, the only people that I'm not strangers with, I think would be Dorian and Amber, because they've met me in the flesh. They've seen the meat sack that is me. Can calculus equations be solved with friendship? I mean, if you want to get to the transitive property, if you have a friend who knows calculus, then in theory, the calculus equation could be solved with friendship. Technically, technically speaking. Technically speaking. Welcome back, Caleb. <laughs> You're so smart. I can't do calculus, though. He's here in work painting the walls, and he's been here like five days, and I did not get near him the second time I saw him. Well, then I would stay away. If he makes you that uncomfortable, I would definitely just avoid. Avoid, avoid, avoid. Stay in school. Stay as long as you can. Fair tell everything can be solved with friendship. That's losing a fight. Friendship about to die. If friendship is strong enough, you can survive. Yeah, maybe. Well, 2000, that's not really a nice thing to say. He could be a very good person. You don't know that. Yeah, I wouldn't uh, just judge a person based on the vibes that they give you. Try and, try and do better. A, that's a very hefty did not mean to use that word that's a very large accusation to not even accusation but large thing to say so a vibe is not enough to say that also that also like Carly says oh god Nick what are you doing what are you doing Ugh. Yeah, Pokemon Home solid. 
Nope, wrong one. Pokemon Home's a super fun game. I beat the Elite Four in it, uh, for the first time last week. Hefty, it was it was on it was honestly just a vocal flub. Might if I don't. Might if I don't. I build my brother for it. I don't know. I don't even know what's happening now. It was super direct. It was it was an accident. There's an elite four in Pokemon Home. Yes, there is. When you have a complete. Like, the complete dex has been entered into Pokemon Home. You get an option to battle. And that's it. What the mods are saying. Good series is Criminal Minds. I've never actually seen Criminal Minds. Cough twice because I was going to sneeze, but apparently coughing is a way to stop myself from sneezing. Scarlet and Violet deserved an Arceus encounter. Scarlet and Violet deserved any shiny, legendary, and mythical encounters, but... You know? It's like, uh, the Beatles say. You can't always get what you want. Sometimes you get what you need. Uh, Criminal Minds always seem like a show that old people would enjoy a hefty amount. Sure does. Sometimes when I see a show that has so many seasons, I get so intimidated by it that I literally can't watch it. Like, Supernatural. I started watching it, I watched two episodes, and I was like, there's 190 of these? No thank you. And then I never watched it again. Like, I don't care how good something is, I'm talking like 50 episode cap. And I'm done. No, 2000, you're not banned. You're not banned. You're not going to be banned. Just change the subject. You're not going to be removed. You're going to keep being here. Just let's chat about something else. Avery loves that show, but he probably started it like at a reasonable time. See, like if I try and get into it now, I'm, I'm toast. Dean and Sam are hot enough. Yeah, see the thing that I run into though is that I'm not super attracted to dudes. So, that makes it a lot harder to get into a show with attractive dudes, because I'm not attracted to dudes. Uh, -da 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 -da. 2000, move on. New subject. Let's talk about Pokemon. What do you like about Pokemon? What Pokemon would you hire to do some work at your summer camp? I don't, I don't know. I don't even know where we're at anymore. They like jokes. I do like jokes. Jokes can be very funny. I told jokes once. I started watching it was on like season three. Exactly. Exactly. I hope they don't say Guard of War. I don't understand the reference because I think I'm a simple brain. Actually, I know I'm a simple brain. Just watching Demon Slayer. Demon Slayer? I don't know. Buffy? I just love the supernatural type shows. I mean, I'm gonna name all the TV shows. Let's see. There's Superstore. There's Mad Men. There's The Wire. There's I Zombie. There's yellow jackets. I think that's all the shows. Oh no, there's also Stranger Things. Oh man, that's not all the shows. There's also Family Guy. Oh man, there's so much. There's so many shows. What's up, Average Apple? I don't know how I'm possibly gonna name all these. 
There's Seinfeld. Um. There's Everybody Loves Raymond. Um, there's Full House. I missed one. This is gonna be impossible. Oh my god, there's Parks and Recreation. That makes sense, 2000. Start again. Oh, man. Okay. Um, there's Better Call Saul. I'm listing all the shows, Razzy, but I'm I'm struggling. Like I thought I got to the end, and then turns out there were even more shows that I didn't I didn't name. Oh man. Um Oh my god, I didn't even get into cooking I didn't even get into cooking shows. All the shows like ever. Yeah, Apple, that's what I was trying to do is every show ever. I didn't even get to cooking shows, and there's so many of those. Oh, uh, this is going to be really hard. I think I just got to stop. I don't think I'll be able to name all the TV shows. Can you name all the people? Oh, my God. I can try. Okay, there's Tony. Uh, there's, there's Shania. There's... There's Phil? Oh man, I don't even know what to do. I don't even know what to do. First, middle, and last name? It's, it's not gonna happen. Arson, I don't know what message you're talking about. Gordon Ramsay? Gordon Ramsay? I mean, there's just so many. It's the amount that there is, I can't even begin. We've done 310 checks today for this bad boy, and not a single one of them has been shiny. What a shame. What a shame for us. This thing's really taking its sweet time. Thanks to everybody hanging out, though. We got a good crop of people. A good crew. There isn't parks and recreation. There's recreation in parks? I don't know what you're talking about. Like, Parks and Recreation refers to a department inside of many cities and municipalities that are responsible for the maintenance of the parks and also the recreation facilities. Like, a tennis court isn't necessarily a park. A swimming pool isn't necessarily a park. But it does fall into recreation. Baseball diamond's not really a park. So, there is Parks and Recreation. It's a department responsible for both parks and activities of recreation. Making breakfast? How is it? What are you having? I was trying to make a joke, but it backfired. Very, very, very much so. Let's let's put that... We're going to put that one... Carson, I'm going to tell you about this thing that I invented when I was seven. It's called the joke bag. It's a bag that you put the jokes that you just don't tell again. Would you ever work as a park ranger? Yeah, I think that would be really cool, actually. I think a park ranger would be a cool job. It would be cool to spend time outside. Okay, here's a joke. What do we got? I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Poached eggs. Avocado and toasted muffin. Excellent raid? I don't know who this is. I'm so very excited. What is this? Oh my god, it's got it has to it has to be Mystic, right? Has to be. Is it Mystic? I don't know who else it would be. What do you call a man with nobody and no nose? Nobody knows. What's up, Evan? Good to see you. We got JJ coming in. We got Cade Gelds Loot. We've got Ice Type Specialist. Oh my god. I don't know. I'm... I just feel like... There it is. What's up, Mystic? Good to see you. Thank you so much for coming in. How was your stream? How... Did you... What were you... What were you... What was... What was happening? What was happening? The way you know sold that... <laughs> What's up, McDazzy? What's up, Michi? Good to see you guys. Thank you for coming in. What's up, Ice Type? God, I, you just, you're just in love with that, aren't you? We got August A, we got Taicho, we got Tessa. Hide and seek. Nice. How was it? How was it? That's awesome. Thank you so much for dropping Mystic's Link, Carly. 
Oh man, Michi, it's just been a strange one. I don't know how else to explain it. Painful? It sounds like it was nice from some people. How do I shiny hunt in outbreaks in violent? Knock him out. Pick him up. Well, thank you so much for the raid. So unbelievably generous. What's up, Casey? Good to see you. That's true. I did create it. It is my it is a creature of my own of my own creation. Bum Mystic in two minutes becoming a pro Taicho. Come on. Any shiny yet? Nah, we just had uh, some really muddy discussions. I was trying to name all the people in the world. I got through like seven before I realized it would be really hard. I tried to name every TV show ever. I got through about eight before I realized it'd be really hard. Remove my cap. Remove your face. Um, That's basically it. I chose Mystic Seeking Radar. What if they're... What if they're watching? Wait, what if they watch your stream and then they just know where you're at? Remove your hands? Dude, remove your teeth. Eat porridge for life. Nobody knows. Gonna ask somebody else. My dad called. What's up, Pops? It's a very specific skill. Can you imagine, like, that's your superpower is that you're able to find Mystic Korea hiding in Pokemon? Man, remove your throat. Dude, remove your toenails. I just sent you a meme on Discord. I will look at it at the proper time. Super close to 2.2. We're getting there. We are almost there. No cheating. Taito, you're just an honorable man. Or woman. I actually don't know. <laughs> I just... I don't know. Never like to assume. What is your favorite rap? Yours is The Rock? You want to go to Cat's Deli in New York City? I would love to go to Cat's Deli. Cool headphones, dude. They're so good, JJ. They're like, they're my favorite. Hope you find the shiny soon. I do too. Remove your toenails brought about horrible memories. I'm so sorry. They make them in wireless. The... Do they? I didn't... Oh, uh, I think they do. I think that's right. I don't like Bluetooth headphones, though. They're... Too much latency happens. Say goodbye to your legs, dude. Get out of here. I'm a real boy. Good, Taicho. This helps me. Yeah, they're they're super nice. They're comfortable. They fit well. The sound quality is amazing for being relatively inexpensive. It's midnight here and my coffee high is crashing. How's work been, Mystic? Send you good shiny bobs. Shiny bobs. Shiny vibes. In case that's what I need. Hey, take care, Mystic. Thank you so much for the raid. Have a great rest of your night. Hope work is going well. We'll talk soon. And we'll rock and roll. Brutal? Yeah, that's work. It's like the old Blink-182 says, Work sucks, I know. But someone will leave you roses by the stairs and surprises will let you know that they care. Ooh, whoever just subbed, thank you so much. You're a legend and I super appreciate you. Really, really awesome. YouTube is recommending that I run an ad right now. Anybody want an ad? Anybody want to watch an advertisement? No, no one does. Makes sense. Not going to do it. Dab me up, but also Stinky's bald head. Yeah, dab it. Why are you drinking that coffee at midnight? No, the coffee crash is wearing off, so she probably drank the coffee a couple hours ago. One ad, please. Let me give you an ad, please. YouTube. So money hungry. Silly YouTube. Masuda method. No, Aqua Phantom, this isn't Masuda method. This is uh this is just soft or er, uh encounter hunting. Masuda method would be we'd be hatching eggs. What's up, Hangman Jacoby? How we doing, bud? I'm a YouTube Premium member. I can't get ads. Well, that's good. Take an ad as an add me to your Discord server? Wait, what? What's even the point of life then? I don't know, man. If you can't get ads, what is the point? Uh, I'm doing good, man. Doing good. Just trying to find this uh, shiny Santa Scorch as quickly as we possibly can and uh, failing to do so, but we'll get it. Eventually, this thing will show up. And if it doesn't, like, that's cool too. But it should. Is 
typically at some point in time, every Pokemon that you hunt will be shiny. This one's just not wanting to do it right away. YouTube Premium is the biggest scam of impatience. I mean, YouTube Premium has got a lot of all other things other than just ads. Have a little nap. If you stream by the time I wake up, this is such a fun stream. Good luck. Hey, take care, Carly. Have a good nap. Are you... Are you streaming today? I would assume you are, right? Are you not? I think you are. I saw, I saw it posted. I just don't know what time it's at. You added the word fun. Oh, I did. Oops. Oops. Uh, why don't you drop your link? Why don't you self-promote? You guys, at the end of my stream, Harley's going to be streaming not that much later. So, why don't you go celebrate with her and watch her do the huntings? Two hours from now. Carly, I actually need something from you if you have it. I'll message you in Discord. What's up, Mega Garchomp? Thanks for stopping in. Um, it's nothing serious. I was just wondering if you have a specific clip. Like, I don't know if you record your streams, too. But if you do, there's something I would need from you. I wouldn't trust him. You can trust me. It is me, Aqua Phantom. Of course it is. Alright, here we go. Rock and roll. I've been meaning to ask. What do we got? We're really getting it today. Bella, from all angles. All sides. Shiny's Awards 2024 when? In May. Be rocking it in May. Do you know how to wrap a burrito? I do. Why? I feel like there's some I feel like there's something associated with this here, but yes, I do. What's up, Mega Garchomp? Hey, what's up, Rosie? I'm just curious. I do. I do know how to wrap a burrito. My name's Burrito, and I'm here to say... I'm the stuffed-up treat in every way. See? I can, wrap, I can wrap a lot of foods. Give me another food. I'll wrap it again. Oh, wrap! W-R-A-P. Oh. My bad. My bad. Oh yeah, no, Mega Garchomp, I got you. I heard you. Shiny's experience, you're getting the full, full extent of it today. Uh, wrap a banana. My name's Banana and I'm here to say I'm the yellowest fruit in every way. There you go. Or green, sometimes. Sometimes green. Yeah, like with my burritos, I like to take this tortilla. I like to take two ends and kind of go like this. And like to take the other two ends and kind of go like this. And then I like to wrap the bottom over all the meat and tuck. Then take one side and then take the other side. And then finish by crimp rolling and then getting it inside of some aluminum foil and tightening that up so that it's real, real firmed up. Now, some people with their burritos, they don't like the burritos to be toasted, but I like the burritos to be toasted. So I toss on a little bit of the George Foreman. I wish I had a little bit more money so I could buy myself a plancha, but I do not have enough money to buy myself a plancha. So instead, I use my George Foreman. I let it toast for enough salad five ish minutes maybe a little less if i put sour cream in there i'll do a little less because i don't want warm sour cream no one wants warm sour cream and then i eat the burrito we get another light goal because we were absolutely crushing it today appreciate all y'all and that's how i roll a burrito Two thousand. I have. I have zero idea what that says. How many sentence scores you find? Well, I found one thousand five hundred forty-two. Hey, take care, Meech. Thank you so much for being here. I don't know why I just shortened it to Meech. It's clearly Meechy Poo, but do you have a living dex? Nah, probably, but like not one that I know that I have, but I probably do. What's a plancha? Plancha is like a, uh, a 
press, a heated press for certain foods. So it's like flat. Like a George Foreman is kind of a plancha, except for it's not very heavy. And it also has like the lines in it. Um, planchas tend to be flat. And then the way that they press is a lot smoother. So they have this like big overhead handle that you go up and down with and it like lands so that the, the two plates are firm with one another and they're completely flat and it's nice so it's good for pressing a sandwich press. It's more than a sandwich press but like if that's what gets you there then yeah, a sandwich press. It's like if you ever had an authentic Cuban sandwich that's what uh, it's made out of. A long time ago there was one dude called Job and that has an O but this time Job is with an Hey, Joe Bluth. Okay, no los dos. Think about that. I think they're talking about pronunciation. I agree. Job versus Job. I think that the reason between those two things is that the name Job would have been a um, an Aramaic or Hebrew name, whereas Job would be from the English Germanic vocabulary and language, so they're just two completely different languages. Like, I'm going to remove that. People might not want to disclose where they're from. Hey, Rianne, what's going? On? What's going on? Uh, so good to see you. Always so good to see you. How's your weekend? How's your Sunday been? Are you too hashtag blessed to be hashtag stressed? Are you too hashtag stressed to be hashtag blessed? Very important distinction to make. Are they called dark with a K and not a C? I don't know. English language is wild. Probably because K really only has one real pronunciation, which is the K sound, whereas C can have other pronunciations, like the S sound. So, in order to make sure that there is no... Potential, I don't know, but etymology is an amazing thing. You could look up the etymology of the word dark and then you would know why it's the way that it is. Because it probably comes from a German word like dunkel. And if it comes from a word like dunkel, maybe the K, which is in dunkel, which instead would not be dunsel, then you would want to make sure that it uh, kind of has that nice Germanic translation over from dunkel to dark. Because you can't see in the dark? Okay, that's actually a pretty good joke. I like that one. I like that one. I said, here's, I missed the, year, hey, I missed the here's a joke part. I got it now. We're in good shape. It was actually pretty funny. Doing two hashtag blessed to be hashtag stressed. I dig it. That's what's up. I'm doing good. Doing good. Um, yeah. I'm getting hungry. So I'm going to eat some food at some point in time. I'm going to have a spaghetti sandwich because I'm in the mood for a spaghetti sandwich. I gotta go grocery shopping today. This really is a stream. It certainly is a Shawshank Redemption. Gotta go grocery shopping at some point in time today. Ah, Bella, it's all part of the fun. Why do it? Why is it hungry and not hungry? Uh, I don't know. Sometimes. Sometimes. Michael, did you throw up in there? Nah, just pooping. You know how I be. It just smells like throw up in there. I'm just confused about what quest to do in Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate. Uh, hunt the Loch Ness Monster. Make sure that you bring exactly three, five, zero gold pieces with you. It's the only way to get it. Is to entice it with the thing that it wants more than anything. Oh, so now it's only two fitty. Razzy, I don't know, I don't, 
I don't know who was all there yesterday, so I don't know if it was you, because I was not paying attention because I was playing Fortnite, but last night, Clocky had 15 Pokemon Crystal emulators going and was doing the resets for Jirachi, or for Celebi, and it was awesome. Like, every 30 seconds. Probably 60 checks a minute. Maybe more. It was so cool. I would love to do, see how many you can actually do at once. If you were a word, what word would you be? Volume. If you were a word, what word would you be? Nick is a word. That's that's actually true. Nick is actually a word. So I guess I could just be Nick. I don't have to really change anything. It's about to get awkward. <laughs> Bread. I like that. Grab some popcorn. <laughs> uh. Get some LED strips for that IKEA cubby. Dude, it's way harder than you think it is. Because you can't just add them on the back. If you want to have it actually be like a nice glow, you have to put like an actual router through the top of the like each individual side panel. And then you have to have them all linked together. Like it's so much effort to do. So I'm looking into it. I just got to figure out how to do it properly because just putting them on the back isn't going to give you that. It's going to look really bad. I was watching YouTube videos about it. But. Carson Hefty will look at Discord eventually. You will see it. Hefty, can you please just, can you just please look at this meme? Like I, I will I will I will send 20 bucks to your PayPal if you will just look at this meme. Please. <laughs> uh <laughs> Oh, I need some spaghetti sandwiches like yesterday. Good meme. I like memes. Like goal 50? I like the question mark. It shows the uncertainty of whether or not we'll get there. And I like realistic things. And that's exactly what that is. Son, you're just a freaking man, dude. You're the man, dude, DJ TV. Do you know what date your Switch is on? May 31st. Shiny Alpha Star Raptor, nice. May 31st. The, the Starly line, I have every Alpha of them twice. Which stinks, because guess how many times I needed them? Once. Once is fine. Once would have been fine. What if I actually get the shiny now? I would sneeze on a piece of toast and mail it directly to you.
And then when you said, Nick, what is this? I would say, oh, I made you some homemade toast and I would love for you to try it. Don't worry, it'll be totally safe. I made sure that it would survive the travels. And then you'd take a bite of it and I'd be like, what up, Bella? You just ate my sneeze toast. And that's what I would do if you got the shiny before me. Would not trust you. I told you it would be totally fine. I would have made it food safe for the, dra the travels. This is what I hate this though, because then you are gonna get it before me. You always get it before me. Auto counter's so great though. Oh yeah, I forget that we're starting tomorrow's morning stream from a really uncomfortable place. I have a cool trivia category for this week. I'm excited about it. It might be really stupid, but I, I'm, I'm liking it. Stop staring into the void. I'm staring into the into the screen. I'm playing on the screen. Why is the camera not centered on Santa Scorch's head? Hmm? Oh, I don't know, cause it's so big. Maybe. I don't know. Void staring. Ba -ba -ba -ba. He's too tall. Yeah, that's exactly it. You know the vibes. Yeah, Bella, how tall are you, by the way? Five eleven, wow. Such height. Much wow. How's the how's the weather up there? Nick says to Bella. It's good. She says back. Oh, well, that's good. He replies. This is going on too long. She says back. Saw you again, 510. I have a shiny one. I'm jealous. I'm trying to get one. It just doesn't want to be here. It doesn't want to show up. Tower over me. You truly do. You truly do. I'm your favorite YouTuber. Well, that's really nice. I'm my mom's favorite YouTuber, too. That's not true. I'm just a YouTuber that my mom watches sometimes. Mega Garchomp, I gotta tell you something. You remind me of a doctor that provides a quiz to people that come to see him. Hey, what's up, Orange? Spillity, who does your mom like? I don't know, just one of them. Yeah, I just thought you should know that, Mega Garchomp. Like, if I had to compare you to something, it would be a doctor that goes out to the waiting room and gives those that have come to see him a quiz.
Are you playing Pokemon? I am. I have a mother. I don't. I don't know. I don't know what that means. I have no idea what that. I have no idea. I don't. These are words that I've never heard before. Mmm, we have a stinky on the on the uh, on the loose. A nice stinky. Why didn't it work? Stinky. Thank you. So why garbage cans expensive? It's almost like they want us to live in filth. I mean, garbage cans are not that expensive for what you like. You use them. Six subs away. Let's go. I have another channel. Oh. Rock and roll. I only have one channel. Yeah, like, if you think about $113, yeah, but if you think about their purpose and what they serve and what you do, and $113 is not, like, a cheap garbage can. That's a pretty, like, decent garbage can. But their whole purpose is to take garbage out of your house. So, you have to decide. Is it worth it? Price elasticity of demand, JJ. Called an opportunity cost. You have two choices you can make. You can have stinky garbage in your house, or you can pay more and have not stinky garbage in your house. Therefore, the price is exactly what it's supposed to be. When did I start YouTube? Almost two years ago. Maybe two years ago in May. Two years in May. Comes Monday. Nice. Good at this game? Well, I'm trying to be uh trying to be lucky and fortunate, but I'm struggling to make my luck happen. I'm struggling to find what I need. I'm like Bono in that regard. I just still have not found what I'm looking for. Maybe someday. Do you have any shiny living decks and legends? No, not yet. But, uh, working on it. Hey, Crystal, how was breakfast? It's going good. We got, uh... We're almost at 400 checks on the day. My old one is 10 years old and rusty. Oh, it's like a metal one? Like a metal garbage can? How many Pokemon do you have? Uh, like shinies or just in general? Um, I have uh 420 or 450 shinies, 20 or 50. I don't remember what it is. One of those two. What am I gonna eat after stream, dude? I'm gonna have a spaghetti sandwich and I cannot wait. Ooh, have you found something good? That was the 1,000th message that has come through chat today. Thank you, Mr. 1,000 message. You're the best. Let me paint the back of that Santa Scorch blue. You seriously should. Sixty dollars used. Huh, that's not bad. What actually is a spaghetti sandwich? Well, you make spaghetti and then you put it between two pieces of bread. Sometimes you toast the bread and make it like garlic bread, and then you eat the spaghetti sandwich. It's so good. No, I definitely wasn't joking. I love spaghetti sandwiches. Is there sauce on it? Oh yeah, for sure. Like you toss the sauce and the pasta together and then you put it in the middle of the sandwich. Sounds like my dad would have eaten. I feel like I'm learning that not like everybody eats spaghetti sandwiches, that it's kind of an, um, like an American thing is kind of the vibe that I'm getting, but man, I love them. They're so good. M&M sells them. Do I love mayonnaise? I tolerate mayonnaise. I want to be you when I grow up? Dude, just, just spaghetti? Wouldn't spaghetti just spill out of the bread? No, because you don't do it with like, okay, so you don't do it with like fresh spaghetti. You do it with like the day old spaghetti where it's kind of like dried up a bit and it's absorbed some of the sauce. That's typically what you would make it out of. I'm just doing it a little different um, because I'm a professional spaghetti sandwich eater, so I can I can take some creative liberties with it. Um, but yeah. Do you heat the spaghetti up? Oh yeah, for sure. 
Yeah, sometimes like if you think about how you would make like a toasty or like a grilled cheese, you can do that with the spaghetti as well. Put it on a nice like flat top. What's my favorite shiny? Shiny Rayquaza for sure, Mr. Businessman. Definitely. Uh, but yeah, yeah, then you toast it and then it's so good. But mine's gonna be a little different today. I'm gonna do kind of like an open faced. I also, you gotta butter the bread too. That's what really makes it shine. Just a little bit of nice butter on the bread. Mm. Who's my favorite Pokemon? Uh, probably Ludicolo. My favorite. Yeah, I'd say probably Ludicolo. I don't know, there's lots of good ones. Jeez, look at all the magmar. I'll tell you what I don't want. There we go. Definitely made it from leftovers that are pretty elevated. Yeah, I think it's just good all the time. What was my first shiny? My first shiny was a Boldor in a raid den on this game, actually. How good would you say that you are at Fortnite? Uh, good getting better. There's, um, yeah, good getting better. I don't know what chip buddies are, JJ. I've actually never heard of that. Um, like last night, I averaged four and a half kills a game. We got, uh, see, I could go consult my stat sheet, but we got first place once, second three times, third twice, uh, in the top 10 twice and outside of the top 10 twice. What's my username? I think it's, I think it's gonna get DM'd to you. I'll send you a message. It's bread with butter and fries. Interesting. Can you say orange is the best? I just did. But orange is pretty cool. Potato, chip, and thick fries on bread. That sounds good. Cracked on Fortnite on my PS4 account. Just want to say good luck. We're all counting on you. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate you. Hopefully we get something. Hey, what's up, Matilda? Love a chip, buddy. I, is this like a thing, or did you guys all... Did you guys all come together, and you said, let's make up something called a chip, chip buddy, and let's talk to Nick about it? Orange, you're the best. You're my boy, Orange. It's British. Ah, uh, Chip Butty? Hmm. Hmm. How do I outbreak Hunt in Legends? Dude, Caleb, you know how to outbreak Hunt in Legends. I would have never guessed that butty was a word. I have to share this with you. I'm ready for it. What is it? How to outbreak hunt in Plaza. Pilza. Pilsner. A fine Pilsner. I started following a big potato cart in the UK, and apparently, uh-oh. Oh yeah, jacket potato, right? Isn't that what they call it? Did we, did you, t I feel like you told me this. I feel like you told, or potato jacket? I feel like you told me this, and it blew my mind. But he's just another term for sandwich, and it's also another term for a butt. The common jacket potato toppings are cheese, beans, chili, coleslaw, and tuna? That's disgusting. That's so gross. Why? Is it difficult to fight this Pokemon? No, not at all. But I don't want to fight him. Welcome back, Mega Garchomp. Like tuna mayo, they'll have it with any combination of those. Oh, I hate that. Nothing wrong with tuna. So much wrong with tuna. On a potato? 
Oh my god. How do, how do British people do it? How do you guys eat food like that? Oh. British food is very bland. JJ, when have you been to have you been to the UK? Hot cheese, beans, chili, and then cold tuna. That's what I'm saying. So strange. It's their palate. Are do you know a lot of British people? Have you been there? Do you love watermelon? I do. I do love watermelon. Guys are going to take a bath and come. I will be back. Alright, bud. See you in a bit. Do shot has get better if you faint many Pokemon? In very small situations. My family's English and mom cooked bland for her mom. Gotcha. Gotcha. Oh. Uh, one Friday, I don't, I, I eat meat on one Friday during Lent in the last like 30 years, and I think today is my punishment. Uh, have, a, have a great bath, Razzy. Love your shirt, thank you. It's a AFC Richmond jersey. Shiny on the third encounter. Let's go. Let's go. Third encounter what? You want flavor, don't go to England. Dude, that's just such a huge generalization. So wrong. Brothers bathing, that's good. Good, it's good to practice proper hygiene. Pikachu, nice. I always told me a staple meal is potato, meat, and veg. Uh, yeah. Maybe. I mean, Gordon Ramsay's from England. Some of the greatest, uh, some of the greatest Michelin star restaurants are in England. England also has a population of like what? A couple million people? He's actually from Scotland Yard, like the board game? Oh yeah, no, tuna on a baked potato is rough. That's really fair. Do you remember me? I do. What's up? How's it going? Welcome back. You think we'll get this center scorch today? I don't know. My favorite Pokemon is Charizard. Charizard's pretty cool. I actually have tuna buddy. Okay, well like a tuna sandwich is okay. No, Kieran, we're, we're fine with tuna. I can't express that enough. I'm good with tuna. What I'm not good with is tossing is tossing old tuna on a hot baked potato. Yeah, tuna on tuna on some uh, some old French fries might be okay too. I know a guy whose grandma is Croatian, she makes Sloppy Joes. All Croatians must eat Sloppy Joes, naturally. What is your favorite color? Black. Black is my favorite color. Razzy is banned from speaking for five minutes. <laughs> because I know, I know what he was typing, and he must erase it. He must erase it. I know where it was going. I know, I know where it was going. Black is a beautiful color, it is. It's very slimming. Oh, well, the men in black just left my house. Ah! Uh, Here come the men in black. Galaxy to mm -hmm. Hey, take care, Orange. Thanks for being here. Appreciate the positivity and the good vibes. We'll talk to you hopefully again soon. 
Uh, feel free to come back whenever. Old English and New English is very different today. Yeah, I think a lot of things are different. Some things are the same. You know it's not the same as it was. That's what Harry Styles would say. Harry Styles is British. He's just a British dude. Harry Styles is native. He is. Harry Styles, Styles is native to England. I wish Harry was spelled Harry. I do too. He really messed up there. Try the jacket with tuna. I mean, I'll try anything four times. So... What I don't understand is why they don't just feed the mayonnaise directly to the tuna. Then you cut a whole step out of the line of production. Oh yeah, I gotta make sure the first three were wrong. Or right. I like extra confirmation. Digging restream. I just don't know if I'm willing to pay for it. That's something I have to figure out. I have a couple more days to trial it and then we'll find out, but it's really cool streaming to a different platform at the same time. I love a restream. I do too. Um it's a really nice overlay too. It's actually wild. I don't know if anybody's been on kick, but it is crazy how low the latency is. I've talked about this a couple times, but it's actually unreal. Like, we're talking less than, less than a second, which is amazing, honestly. feels fast too. YouTube always seems like the one with the huge delays. I think they are because they support um, higher resolutions and um, higher resolutions and higher uh, bit rates. So I think that's probably part of it. Like YouTube supports a 10,000, like I think they support unlimited bit rate actually, um, whereas some of the other ones do not. Hey, what's up, Lola? Is amazing. Thank you so much for uh, finding me being back. You're wonderful. Um, Ramsey born November 8th, 1966 in Johnston, Scotland. Cool. He's a Scotsman. He does MMA? Wait, like Gordon Ramsay does MMA? Like, does he cook for them or does he like actually fight? Hey Tyler, thanks for the lurks, buddy.
Gives them a knuckle sandwich. Wow. Does he also deliver them a Hertz donut after? Kieran, you ever had a Hertz donut? Look, while playing Minecraft? Nice. Have fun. Yeah, it hurts, don't it? Can I get some eggs? Can I offer you a nice egg in this trying time? What's up, Dorian? How's it going, man? So good to see you. Uh, hey, Carl. So good to see you. After you, I don't think you're still here, are you? Do you have bacon? No. Hey, take care, Lola. Thanks for being here. All right, y'all. We got one more check coming up for the day, and then uh, we're going to do a little bit of something. Uh, oh, hefty. BT dubs. Uh, you know what you DM'd me about? Check it now. All right, y'all, that is it. I'm back from my bath, and boy, am I tired. Yeah, I bet you weigh about a pound less, too. All right, that's it. We did 450 encounters today and did not get a single, single thing. What a bummer, but that's okay. I appreciate all y'all spending time with me. Hefty, thank you so much for the raid. Mr. Korea, thank you for your raid as well. Uh, big shout out to two months for Justin, seven months for Tyler, and five gifted memberships for me. What about Grits? Everybody say sausage, keep going. Eggs, bacon, grits, sausage. Don't get shinies, but I eat that sausage. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're not gonna go on a raid because there's not really anybody live right now. Um, but my friend Carly is going live in an hour and 14 minutes. Can you please do me a favor? Just jump over there and drop a like on her stream. That's all we wanna do. Don't say that it's a raid. Don't do any of that. It's not a raid. We're just going over and supporting someone before they get started. It's always really nice to uh, start the day off with a good amount of likes. There's 15 of you here, which means that her number should say 15 likes by time uh, she gets started. So please head on over that way. Carly's fantastic. Going to be going live uh, in Sword and Shield as well. So let's give a little bit of support to the game. Thank you guys for being here. Have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow morning for some trivia, for some Groudon and some Latios hunting. And uh, yeah, go out there. Do some good. We'll talk to you soon.